What's going on guys and welcome to another bonus video for the day. I know I'm doing two videos today, but today I'm going to be reviewing Mother, uh, directed by Darren Aronofsky and stars Jennifer Lawrence, Javier Bardem, and um, Michelle Pfeiffer and Ed Harris. And this film I think is good. I think it's good. Um, it's very unsettling. Very, It makes you very uncomfortable. I mean, it stressed me out <laughs> a lot, especially during the third act. I'll get into that in a little bit. But uh, Jennifer Lawrence is amazing as this character uh, named Mother, who is, it's about um, a couple who lives in this kind of, uh, in this, this old house that uh, Jennifer Lawrence's character is rebuilding. And um, they live together. He's a, a Javier Bardem plays a, a writer who's struggling to find his creativity and and figuring out what he what he wants to write. And um, it is they slowly um, get a knock on the door, and then another knock on the door, and they meet these people who they have no idea. But Javier Bardem lets them in and lets them stay with them. And sooner, uh, before too long. They have a bunch of strangers in their house. And that's the basis for the movie. Um, now, I love Darren Aronofsky. I think he is a fantastic director. Black Swan, I loved. I loved Black Swan. Um, this film, on the other hand, he is trying to tell, make a statement um, about the planet and about uh, people. And... Um, he uses a lot of metaphors and allegories and references to religion, and I, I get it. And a lot of people are saying this, that the movie is pretentious, and I agree. I agree that it is very pretentious, and I feel like the, some of the metaphors are obvious. And that's where the film kind of is a negative for me, because I felt like, okay, they're making this... Um, reference. Okay, I get it. They're trying to say this. Um, he's trying to say this. I get it. And once you get it, you get it. And it, but it keeps going. And it's like, okay, enough. You know. Um, um, especially in the third act. In the third act, and if you see the movie, you'll know what I'm talking about. There's a scene. This almost the final thirty minutes of the film is insane. Just nonsense after nonsense that happens. Um, and it's just like. Okay, is it necessary? I don't know. I I think it's well done, but it's a little much. <laughs> I think it's a little too on the nose, a little too obvious, a little too okay. I see, but that like, it, but then there are other references in the film, especially to religion, that I that I think works great. There's a there's a Cain and Abel kind of reference uh, in about halfway through the movie that I think works. Um, really well i think it works really well um but then again in the third act all these metaphors are just like they're just too obvious and too i don't know over over dramatic i guess um but overall i think it's a good film i think it's a good film is it worth i don't know it's it's good i like it but I like you said the 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 statement is a little obvious and to some people it's not like I, when I went to see it, I saw it um, last night and I walked out of the theater and people were just the people that I saw it with were, I heard someone said, I heard, I heard someone say like, what was that? Or like, um, that was a waste of time or something like that. And I can see why audience would think that I could see where people, cause it's marketed as like a horror psychological horror thriller film and it's not it's not that at all it's it's a statement piece um and that's about it it's a statement piece and people i think will be confused about that overall though i think it's good if you like a good statement piece it's a little obvious but check it out if you guys want i'm not saying it's a bad film it's not a bad film it's not bad at all um it's good it's good it's just a little much for me <laughs> But anyways, that's going to be it for me today. Um, stay tuned for Wednesday where I will be continuing my David Fincher series. Um, we're getting kind of close to the end. I think I have three more films to get through. Um, so Wednesday I will be doing that. And then Friday, stay tuned for Kingsman, the Golden Circle review. Thanks. 
Oh, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you on Wednesday.